Looking for the best commuter e-bike for cruising? Today we're comparing two popular options, the Aventon Electric Bike Pace 500.3 and the Model C e-bike from Electric Bike Company. Both of these e-bikes have their own unique set of features and appeal, but which one gives you the smoothest ride and best value for money? We'll be delving deep into their specifications, performance and overall riding experience. Ready to pedal into the details? Let's dive in. Starting with the Model C, it's a classic comfort cruiser designed for luxury, leisure, sport and safety. Its standout feature is the extensive customization options available online. You can personalize everything from fork type, frame color, wheel size to chain guard and even the battery. Speaking of the battery, the default option provides 60 miles of range. However, should you crave more, there's the option to upgrade to a 200 mile range for an extra $1,300. The Model C is equipped with a five speed setup but can be upgraded to seven speeds for $50. The bike boasts a 750 watt motor, enabling it to reach a maximum speed of 28 miles per hour. It has a weight capacity of 420 pounds and comes with the renowned Tektro Dorado hydraulic disc brakes, which facilitate single finger braking. For those concerned about comfort, the Model C offers high-density foam seats and a seat post with a 50mm travel distance to prevent saddle soreness. And for the tech savvy, it features an LCD color display. However, it's not all sunshine and rainbows. The default battery range of 60 miles is average and the nicest features such as the rear rack accessories, 200 mile range battery and anti-security features all come with an additional cost. While the Model C offers an extensive range of features, it does come with a price. Now let's shift gears and check out the Aventon Electric Bike Pace 500.3. The Pace 500 is a cruiser that combines comfort with performance. This e-bike is powered by a 500 watt motor that can propel you to a top speed of 28 miles per hour, matching the speed of the Model C. With a range of up to 60 miles, it's ready for long leisurely rides or daily commutes. The comfort of the pace is undeniable. Its cushioned saddle, swept back handlebars and upright riding position make it a pleasure to ride. It's also versatile, offering four new pedal assist levels, Eco, Tour, Sport and Turbo, giving you control over your ride's intensity. The pace is a class two e-bike out of the box with pedal assist and throttle going up to 20 miles per hour, but it can be unlocked to a class three e-bike, allowing speeds up to 28 miles per hour on pedal assist. The payload capacity is 300 pounds, slightly less than the Model C, but still sufficient for most riders. The Pace 500 is also compatible with iOS and Android phone apps, and it offers a backlit LCD display that keeps you informed of your speed, battery life, and pedal assist level. One of the standout features of the Pace is its torque sensor, which recognizes your pedaling efforts and amplifies your natural momentum, conserving battery life. However, the Pace 500 does have its limitations. Its color and accessory choices are somewhat limited compared to the Model C. The Pace offers a great ride, but its customization options are limited. So, how do these two e-bikes stack up against each other? Let's break it down. The Model C and Aventon Pace 500 both offer impressive performance, with a top speed of 28 miles per hour and a range of 60 miles. However, the Model C edges ahead with its 750 watt motor compared to Aventon's 500 watt offering. Now, if customization is your thing, the Model C takes the cake. You can personalize almost every aspect of this e-bike, from the fork type and frame color to the wheel size and battery. The Aventon Pace 500 III, while sleek and stylish, doesn't offer the same level of customization. When it comes to cost, the Model C starts at a lower price point. But keep in mind that adding upgrades and accessories can quickly escalate the price. On the other hand, the Aventon comes with a slightly higher price tag, but its default configuration includes features like a torque sensor, which comes as an extra on the Model C. In terms of battery range, the Model C provides the option to upgrade to a whopping 200 miles for an additional cost, a feature that the Pace 500 lacks. Whether you value customization or performance, there's an e-bike for you. Remember, the best e-bike is the one that suits your needs. Happy cruising.